Voters in cities across Washington County nearly doubled the turnout of the primary, showing up at the vote center on Tuesday. Many came to the Dixie Center to cast their ballots in person for the municipal general election. Right now we have 255 and we still have about five more hours to go. So, The increased turnout was attributed to the importance of those who make local decisions. The mayor and the city council make a lot of decisions that are, you know, directly related to your everyday life. So, I mean, it's important to vote. And turning out in person is a preference many voters choose to make sure their vote is counted in this election. Why did you decide to come in and vote today? Because <laughs> it's, it's part of my livelihood. So, yeah, yeah I've got to make sure we're supporting the community and you know, getting the leaders in there that care about St. George and, and Southern Utah. Mail ballot voting is fast becoming the most popular way to vote. There were more than 28,000 ballots that had already been processed prior to Election Day. I think here in Washington County we really like it a lot. People seem to like to sit down at their kitchen table and pull up the internet and read about the candidates and decide who they want to vote for and make their, their selections and send it back to us. And despite what many people may believe, the system here in Utah is considered one of the most secure in the country, as it's backed up by paper. Every signature is checked. The ballots are handled with utmost care. They're preserved for years. So if there's ever a need to go back and check, you can find the exact ballot that was processed. These on the city elections are kept for two years. And this machine right here scans them, records them instantly, and then they're put in storage so that they can be referred to if you ever need to. However, a new style of voting was tested this year in 23 cities across Utah, including Salt Lake. Rank choice voting is where voters can rank those on the ballot in order of who they like the most, followed by their second and third choices. Ranked choice voting really takes the whole list of candidates, the whole list of names, and lets you have in one vote, you pick in order who you like. So when it gets to the end of the day and we do the results, if the person at the top isn't winning by over 50% plus one vote, they're going to turn around and take all the bottom votes and redistribute who those votes go to. Does that make sense? And when they redistribute it, they send it through some kind of algorithm that is supposed to then make it so that you will see, it, it will change the results many times. Somebody won't be the bottom anymore, they'll move up, or somebody in the middle could move to the top. However, as an auditor of elections, Lewis doesn't believe this style of voting is right for Washington County. For me, it's more of an auditing issue. I want to know that if I'm supposed to get up before some city council or for some county commission and canvas the results and certify the election, that I feel comfortable certifying it. If I haven't ran those results myself and I don't have control of those results myself, you know, that data is passed off to somebody, how can I certify that I'm not a fan? And voters who like to go to the polls with a more clear choice agree. The ballots and the way we vote right now, it is pretty black and white, it's pretty simple, and it's organized. And with the ranked voting system, it is now going to, again, cause confusion uh, whether at the, in the voting station or whether it confuses people on the issues. Regardless of which type of system one might use, it still comes down to a popularity contest. And this year, it appears to have been women. I'm not even sure we've had that many candidates that have been women in the past, but I'm, I totally applaud it. I think it's awesome. And as we're getting the results in, we're finding a lot of them on our, are on top. So I, I love the women are standing up and saying, okay, let's get some stuff done. Most all agree that local elections are among the most important races to turn out for. In Washington County, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.